introverts, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Mina here. Bye. But it was a commentary video, guys. I'm here with a brand new episode of Invincible. Last episode, they were baiting us. You know, I was waiting for the title the whole entire episode, but they only gave it to us at the end. And it's changed. It's no longer bloody. It's cracks. It's cracks. There's a lot of cracks this season, apparently, even in the first episode, it's obvious. Mark is very much depressed. His mom is also very much depressed. The world is recovering from the Omni-Man effect. <laughs> They're also covering, recovering from the fact that he isn't there anymore. So a lot of villains and stuff, you know, they're making their entrances. Now, what we found out was the fact that in other dimensions, Mark joins his father and this is like one the very few very few times there have been a Mark that hasn't gone and you know join up with his father so the guy that could travel dimensions wanted all the knowledge and stuff from the other dimension so he gathered himself in one place and wanted to put all their knowledge into his head unfortunately for him he went and worked with bad guys mark was sent to stop him and shut down this machine that they didn't know what could you know happen which was very stupid because i feel like yeah he should have gone about it better you know he broke criminals out of jail why would you not expect someone to stop you right so now he's a bit loony he has everyone's all his other selves <laughs> in his head it's all jumbled a mixed mesh of um murder and mayhem so in the majority of the universes mark is the bad guy so he sees mark as the bad guy so i'm, I'm ready to see how he begins his path of vengeance because um mark got his ass beat again but you know he was jumped so i'm not too pissed about it i'm just tired of seeing him beaten up I think he deserves a break at this point. At least he got into college, the same college as his girlfriend, Amber. They are still together. So yeah, <laughs> let's jump right into episode two of Invincible. But of course, I want to remind you guys to head on over to the booksudaman.com. It's an awesome book recommendation website filled with awesome book recommendations and book reviews. If you subscribe to my website, you get 50% off being an introvert store. And I cater to my fellow introverts, book lovers, and anime heads. So guys, make sure you check that out. I have a few sneak peeks at the end of the video, so make sure you stick around. I also have a promo code Barnes & Nobles for you guys that like books and manga and all the good stuff. Know that if you click the link and you buy something from that link, <laughs> I'll be able to get a commission from that because I am an affiliate marketer. And yeah, guys, let's jump right into Invisible Episode 2. This one is called In About Six Hours, I Lose My Virginity to a Fish. Okay. Okay. The mortals now in charge. We are down, Houston. If a single sacred fuses with one of your people, they will rise up as one. Oh, they're showing in the recap all the side stories. All the stuff that went wrong. <laughs> and how is this dude the life? I'm better. I'm stronger. I'm ready. No, you're not. I'll work for you. Just put me back out there. Put me in, coach. For some of you, it probably seemed like this day would never come. Oh, Mark is graduating. He's an adult. Maybe you're even wondering if you're ready for this. You are. I look out at this class and I see hope. I see a bright new world. Oh, she is staring. Girl, blink. Guys. Mark's not seriously going to miss his own graduation, is he? He's just running a little late. This is why I quit superheroing. I mean, you only get to say goodbye to high school once. It needs to be enjoyed, appreciated, savor. He'll be here. He promised. He has things to do. I will promise. So, uh, Professor Seismic, right? Doc Seismic. I don't remember his name. I never taught. But didn't you fall into like a huge pool of lava? I fell into a new realm of understanding. Do you know what this obscene phallus is constructed from? He asked, expecting some idiotic answer. Uh... <laughs> Girl, they got me supposed to answer. You can keep the ones made of wood. Everything hey. else, 
We're taking back. Oh. Oh! Destroyed. What the hell? Meet my magma knights. A magma knights? And why were they just standing around? You guys know. I don't understand. They know what kind of world they live in. Why stand there? Let's go, Mark. Oh, damn it, Mark. Let's do this. Oh. His powers are very destructive. Do not be afraid. For without adversity, there can be no triumph. Mm. Okay. Without testing your limits. Yeah, test that, Mark. Let's go. Yeah, let's go. Oh, damn it. I really thought that was a... That was something that was gonna happen. Oh, Mark. Let's do this. Oh, <laughs> annoying. Oh, just ruined the building some more, but you know. Before he destroyed another one of America's greatest treasures. It's not destroyed. I could, you know, I could try pushing it back out to, you know. Do not. Yeah, don't touch it. Don't, don't touch it. <laughs> the great Abraham Lincoln once said, "Whatever you are, be a good one." As Did he though? <laughs> oh, I'm dead. Hey there, hero. Good timing. He looks older. Oh man, wait till I tell you about this guy. He's a case against. I don't know. I don't know if it's like depression. How he's drawn? He looks older somehow. Maybe it's how he's drawn. I don't know. Marcus Sebastian Grayson. Is his mom there? Samantha Eve Wilkins. Yay, Eve! Is Sebastian. Some secrets should never be revealed, Justine. Everyone, please rise. I mean, they're low key cute. I can't even cap. But still. Oh god damn it Mark. Be bold. Be original. Be <laughs> Okay. Are we back on it right now? Okay. You're gonna be catching me by surprise now? Oh, you guys are in East Bungalow? Nothing but swimming pools and sleeping late for two whole months. On the weekends. Maybe. I'm at the community center Mondays, Tuesdays, and Thursdays. Oh, and did I tell you guys I'm volunteering for the Katie Giles campaign? That's your idea of a summer <laughs> vacation? I'm going to find the trashiest reality show I've never heard of and binge every episode twice. Good plan, good plan. I'm just happy helping people. Speaking of... <laughs> God, I love having superhero friends. <laughs> even take me flying anymore boo hiss to graduation and new beginnings no boo hiss i'm on call see some might need me you're always on call now that's the job he does seem so older hardened i'm telling you this martian problem isn't gonna fix itself they were gonna execute us we, we barely got off that rock alive come on they were trying to save their planet from their own slaves <laughs> Send up that invincible guy again. <laughs> You're talking about starting an interplanetary war. How are we feeling? Okay, so we, we're fixing. Oh, is this the one that got, you know. Is that how you say it? Martians? Taking over? Um, I have to visit uh, the urination chamber. Not a nation chamber. Guys. Uh, not yourself. But it's been months, and quite frankly, Livingston. This is the U.S. Space Administration, not therapy. Oh, God. No. Well, I, I don't know how else to say this. Please don't kill me! What? <laughs> Immediately, you're taking a temporary leave till you can get your head on straight. What about the sticky thingy? The, the brain thingies? The star rose? <gasps> oh, shit. <laughs> Guys, we're scared. I 
let's go Eve. Mm. You know what? Go stuff your coat up your ass. I live in that building. That's and right. if it was up to the bureaucrats, we'd be sleeping in high school gyms until Labor Day. <laughs> Thanks. Thank you. Mommy! Does this mean we can go? Oh god. Are they gonna die? I am scared. How long I've been banning the city to clean up that mess? Oh, but unless you know somebody, good luck. You know me, don't you? Oh, okay, sis. Aww. With powers. She's amazing. No, no. Everything's fine. Great, actually. I was just thinking about you and... Is something wrong? Oh shit, her dad died? I told Cecil those contractors he hired were total amateurs. Can we please not do this right now? Sorry. I guess we're both still a bit raw. Girl, you was a pet. A fancy hotel? Bermuda? Maybe St. Lucia? Seriously? Call it a graduation present. Uh, I mean, I want to, but... Cecil told me the Guardians are working out some issues, and I don't know if I can take off right now. Well, what about taking the time to enjoy your last summer being a kid? Right? Mark, come on! Maybe he's still a kid. Don't really look like one, but no. <laughs> I understand why you think you have to prove yourself, but you don't. You're a good person. No one thinks you're going to turn out like your father. But then why would you even say it? Oh, I'm, s I'm sorry. That's not what I meant. Mark, I need you. Thank God. What? I have to go. Wait, Mark. Dude, she's all you got right now. Mm. I've got a boo boo that could use some duplicates. <laughs> oh. <sighs> First of all, we are not dating. And second, that's inappropriate language for the workplace. Wait, I, I know that look. <sighs> <sighs> oh, are you shitting me? You goddamn geriatric come on! You and I were never a thing. The immortal and I are. Oh! He may have come from the stars, but Martian Man will always be one of Earth's greatest superheroes. Oh, is, is this what he's gonna do? Is he gonna try to say he's Martian Man? We've had multiple corroborated sightings of Darkwing. Which is perturbing me, considering that I personally ID'd what was left of his ribcage last year. No? Is this a demon? Uh, sorry. It's okay. So. Oh no. Midnight City. Been a virtual no man's land since the Midnight Magician cursed it back in 02. So, when you say cursed, is that <laughs> right? like a metaphor or. <sighs> what the hell? I mean, it's cursed. Permanent midnight, perpetual darkness, summer on the dark side of the moon. It's Gotham. <laughs> People live here? Please. Somebody help me. Somebody, everybody, anybody. Oh, I am helping. Who is this? Is this the replacement for the other guy? That was like Batman? Oh, Dark Wing. Okay, okay, okay. This is a new one. I was Night Boy, his assistant. Assistant? What, you mean sidekick? We don't use that term. It's degrading. Okay, a little bring bit. Him in. He's lost it. You think? You hear them too? Huh? You never know. Watch it. Huh? Okay, so he has powers? Ow! I felt that. My predecessor developed this exoskeleton to help even the field against those like you. Oh, okay. Well, the explanation is nice. Some hand to hand stuff. Welcome to the Shadow Verse. Okay. I like the old Darkwing better. Me too. I'm the hero here. I'm saving the world from Omni Man's son. Hey, don't call me that. Let go. Not until you take me back. Well. Hmm. Guess who they'll eat first. 
She would never. Like you said, I'm Omni Man's son. Ooh, don't lean into it. You have no idea what I'm capable of. Please don't lean into it. I know you you're doing it to be scary, but still. Mark? We lost you for a minute. Where were you? Ooh. You'll have to ask Dark. Dad! Dad was a double what what you call those? Double entros? <laughs> what? Yeah, that was a that was a um that a double meaning effect. My god. Where's the dictionary when you need it? <laughs> I gotta sign off. Something just came up. Anything I can do? I doubt it. Ooh. Debbie, what a pleasant surprise. She about to want to you ass. That you're in control, not him. That he's not like his father. Debbie? I can't believe you'd even think that after everything Mark went through. And what if you decide you can't trust him? What then? That won't happen. I wish I believed you. Girl, it's time for you to suit up, okay? Get some, get something. D Donald? Debbie, are you okay? Who? She was just leaving. Oh, he gonna live without his assistance, so he got a clone. You don't sound fine, Mom. Are you and Dad fighting again? No, is this a divorce? Oh, she's pregnant. I don't think so. This... Mm. Mom, why didn't you say something? You know I can help out. Samantha! There! Turn it back, please. Before your father gets home. Why? What's going on? What is going on? Oh! He got fired! Oh, God. Why didn't you tell me? Maybe you should have asked. Instead of flying off to God knows where, doing God knows... Maybe you should stop being a dick. Oh, <laughs> I'm taking you to lunch. Ooh, unexpected, but appreciated. Let me go grab my bag. Okay, you can look now. I mean, that is a flex. Oh my God. You brought me to Paris? Sort of. Oh, no. Vegas? Just Las Vegas. Okay, yeah. Okay. You only get an hour for lunch, and I can't fly you to Europe that fast without your skin ripping off. So... <laughs> it's still a sweet gesture. I'm still... Well, I didn't want to get you all the baggage of dating a superhero without any of the perks. Oh! Dinner tonight, instead. <sighs> Go save the world and... Okay, first of all, you gotta bring her back home. You're way too good for me. Hmm. Also, I need to take you back to work first. Thank you. Because I was like, sir, what are you doing? Turns out the Atlanteans are sore about Omni Man murdering their King Aquarius. Oh. Since your dad vanished like a fart in a hurricane, Atlantean law dictates that his sentence falls to his next of kin. Oh, shit. You. They threaten to erase the eastern seaboard if we don't deal with this. You want me to go to. Oh, he's gonna fight their strongest, I think. The way to atone for the king's murder is to marry his widow. What? It's what? an honor. When you think about it. I can't marry a fish. I have a girlfriend. Okay, the title makes a little more sense now. Okay. Will I have to, you know. Consummate? Right, what exactly am I looking at? You're right. Ugh. Sorry, kid. I got another fire to put out. Good luck down there. I'll be listening. Like abandonment? I thought you're supposed to be looking out for him. Nope. Not this bullshit again. I'm not doing another me. What is that? That me better not be you, Rudy. It's not. <laughs> Who are you? I call me the Shapesmith. Oh. Not the shapesmith. I called me. <laughs> That's cute. He's <laughs> <It's> weird. <laughs> this said, I called me. <laughs> no, we've never seen women. This. We've only seen the guys, I think. I mean, the girls are mermaids. Mm -hmm. He can 
not drown, right? I don't think. Not really. Could hold his breath like forever. He, he's been to space, <laughs> right? So, oh, well. Oh, Welcome. You've seen the women who slayed my husband. Oh, I can't do this, and definitely not here in front of everyone. Okay, I, I think this is kind of awkward, but I have a girlfriend. I commended this kingdom for a decade while Aquarius played dress up with you humans. Oh, then we're not getting married? We abolished that barbaric custom. Okay. What do you think we are, savages? Okay, it's our arena then. So, what's a new law? We're gonna fight. Trial by combat. Yep. Release Knew it. Depth dweller. Not a depth dweller. A depth or depth? Depth would make more sense, right? <gasps> it's adorable. I want it. Wait, you want me to fight that? Seems a little unfair. I think that's like a part of its head. You know how fishes have that that light bulb? Yeah, I think it's 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 the light bulb to something bigger. Oh, Seriously? she's selling the house. Okay. Oh no, she's a real estate person, agent. <laughs> When are you taking offers? Wednesday. Whoa! Slow down. I was just asking. Yeah? Well, don't bother. We're definitely not offering on this place. It's in our price range. We like the location, the school- It's too far from the office. You want me to get home even later? There's excellent local transit. Of oh! Not talk to the hun, sir. You earn the money, you can decide where we live. Ooh. She's not your pet. <laughs> It's a trigger. It's a trigger. <laughs> same, sis. Same. Oh. You take the rest of the day off. I'll call you later. She's not your pet. Oh, that word, that statement <laughs> for the rest of her life. <laughs> so she needs a boss up. You ain't nobody's pet, sis. No help. Ah, oh, shit. Really, no help. A little faster. Invincible. They tried to kill you. They were cheering. All they wanted was justice for what my dad did. You're not your father, Mark. That's why I'm going back. Okay, I respect that. I like that. Oh, she did? Oh, okay. Sis, swim! That's literally what you do. Oh, let's do it. Come on. Yes, Mark! That's what I'm talking about. Winning. <laughs> I love that for you. He really needs to start working out though. <laughs> His dad is like, Hur. Mark, you need to train, like lift some buildings and stuff. Work on your, yourself. Oh shit. Oh, ew. What is that? Sir, when Debbie came to speak with you, she seemed uh, distressed when she when she saw me. And she's a distressed person. <laughs> this dickhead. She's a distressed person. He's a dick. Oh yeah? Like you help Chicago? Adam, don't. What? <clears throat> the whole lot was unstable. 
That's why the city never built there. It's a miracle nobody was killed. Oh, shit. This is what happens when you think rules are just for us pathetic normal people. He is such a menace. Girl, you need to sell this house. Mark is going off to school. You don't, regardless of this renovation, buy the damn house. The other one. Fuck you, motherfucker. Oof. We need to do some Taekwondo and some Tai Chi. All the ties. Because this is going through it. Oh my god, it's okay. It's okay. You're not a pet. Okay. Awkward. I think you guys should move, honestly. Hey, you hurt her today. You hurt her today, Mark. It's okay, Debbie. Forgive me for questioning your authority, immortal. But we don't know anything about the Shapesmith. I can tell you. I can tell you. I can tell you. <clears throat> I was born a baby human right here on the planet of Earth. Okay, yeah. Not suspicious at all. Oh, he just abandoned his people. <laughs> because I am a normal human superhero. Stop. Am I in? No. No, guys. <laughs> we are the Lizard League, and we are unstoppable. Oh, are we you? We're unstoppable. We're unstoppable. She is embarrassed. <laughs> oh, shit. Who did that? If anyone is going to turn this organization around, it's going to be King Lizard! Any objections? Okay. Give me that credit! The Pentagon. They were smart. After our ultimatum, they ambushed my dad with experimental quantum bombs. Still cost them most of Europe. <laughs> and they just... wore me down. Caught me when I finally had to sleep. Okay. Mm. So he's gonna get Invincible to kill Invincible? That's stupid. Kind of smart. But stupid. <laughs> That's what I said. Oh my god, are they versions of the guy? Then whose problem are you? Oh yeah! And his. Okay. Well, not his, but... Close enough. Make him pay for what he did to your world. What? Stop! Hey, you promised you'd help me! Hey! Don't leave me here! Okay. So you just went there to mock Mark? What the heck? He's gonna make sure all the Invincibles are locked up? Or he's gonna tell everyone to... He, I, he, I think he just might frame Mark. Since he has nothing on him. Well, guys, that was another episode of Invincible. <laughs> it was a great episode. I enjoyed this one as well. Um, nothing big. Nothing too broad. <laughs> the Martian is killing me. <laughs> like I was born, a human baby, right here <laughs> in this space. <laughs> Mark's doing a little better. A little of a workaholic, you know, trying to pave the way. Um. One thing I can point out is when C Zul was like lost you there for a moment. And I really think they did for a second. Mark went dark. <laughs> yeah. He didn't kill anyone, but he went dark. But you know, on a brighter side, he did help people that tried to kill him. So, you know, progress on some stuff. Debbie's going through it. <laughs> As Cecil <Cezo> said, <laughs> she's distressed. Um, it's very sad though, you know, it's seeing how she was married to someone, she loved him, had a baby by him, and this nigga said she was a pet. Never met a 
that's what a woman scorn, Omni Man. Debbie is coming for you. However she can. She's coming. She's gonna whoop that ass. Might not be physically. Maybe it might be verbally. I don't know why, but I'm hoping Debbie gets some powers. And just like tear Omni Man's ass up. She doesn't even need to win. I just need her to throw a punch that wouldn't hurt her, you know? It would like Yeah, it would make my day. <laughs> but the stuff about Eve. Yeah. That was sad. Her parents ain't shit. I want to tell mom is better than the dad, but the mom lets the dad bully her all the time. It's like, sis, say something. But I guess they had enough arguments on their own. I don't I don't know what's going on in that household. That's a dick. Immortal should stay away from, you know, he's the leader. I don't think he should be sleeping with his teammates. He's not a child. And Casey is not a child. I am aware, but as the acting leader and the oldest person there, again, he his maturity is mind-boggling for his age. Sir, this is not what you do. Unless they were together previously, prior to him getting on a team, but this nigga was dead prior to that, right? He was recovering. What the hell? <laughs> he immortal is continuously disappointing me. Continuously. Get your rocks off, sure. Whatever. Not inside of the the space or with your teammate though. For us the thing with um Invincible with Mark and instead of you know being a little of uh, a, a mentor, he he basically threatened him. Now this thing would duplicate. Dude, you need to grow up. Be better. <laughs> really. Well guys, please like, subscribe, comment, let me know what you guys think down in the description box below. There's links to my Woodpad stories, guys. Make sure you check that out. There's also links to Mina the Introvert store on Etsy and booksyman.com. And don't forget to stick around till the end of the video. I have a promo for you guys and some sneak peeks. All links will be in the description box. Make sure you check it out. And yeah, that's it for tonight, guys. Until next time.